In this lesson, we're gonna talk about the functionality and usage of Azure Service Health. And this is all about getting a personalized view of the health of Azure services, Azure regions, and resources in general. This is easier to understand by just looking at it. So if we jump over to the portal, if we go all the way down to the bottom to help and support, if we select that, we can go into this idea of service health. Now this is gonna break down into a number of different things. Firstly, we can select what do we care about? Uh, do I care about certain regions? Do I care about certain services? Certain subscriptions? And right now it's showing me there are no service issues found. It tells me about upcoming planned maintenance on my resources. It's telling me about health advisories that may exist, maybe things that are gonna happen, things that I should do, security advisories. And what I can have is this idea of health history. So to actually show you this, if I go back three months, here I can actually see, well, there, there have been some issues. And what it's gonna do is for any of these issues, notice some of these are actions recommended, some of them were actual problems. And if it's actual problems, once it's closed, well, firstly, we'll get updates. As the issue is happening, this will get updated typically hourly as to what's happening, so I know what's going on. And then a couple of days after it's resolved, you'll get a root cause analysis so I can understand as the customer what actually happened, what caused that. So I, I have an idea of exactly what was happening in the environment. One of the other things I can do is I can create a health alert. So I can actually get notified, let's reload that, if there's certain types of events that I care about, it could actually notify me, because maybe I wanna be proactively notified. So here you've got one here, hey, service health alert on this certain region, there was something happened. This is something I created, but I could absolutely add new service health alerts based on specific services on specific regions based on different types of events. Hey, plan maintenance, health advisory, service issues. And I can call those same action groups we had in Azure Monitor to actually get told about those. So service health is great to go and look at maybe what's happening that's impacting me, but I can also create those alerts so it will proactively tell me when these things are happening so I don't just have to go and look and find them myself. 